With your look around the Air Force, I'm Staff Sergeant Benjamin Cooper. When I'm flying, I put my helmet on, my visor down, my mask up. You don't know who I am, but I'm African American, Asian American, Hispanic, white, male or female. You just know I'm an American Airman, kicking your butt. A new Air Force recruiting commercial features General C.Q. Brown Jr., the Chief of Staff, delivering an air power and diversity message. The commercial supports the recruiting service's efforts to reach into traditionally underserved communities, letting people know about opportunities to fly in the Air Force through General Brown's Rated Diversity Improvement Initiative. Heavy rainfall in Germany caused flooding around Spengdalem Air Base. Local communities reached out to the base for aid and within two hours, a team of volunteers from the 52nd Civil Engineering Squadron delivered about 1,800 sandbags to homes and businesses in the area. Airmen also augmented a local fire department while Air Force fire trucks and other equipment cleared storm drains and helped redirect the flow of flood water. The base had only minor damage to about 13 facilities as a result of the floods. The CE Ops flight commander said about 80% of the people working on base live in local communities. And if the base can help in any way, they always will. After 16 years of development, two years in orbit, and over 1,300 experiments, the Demonstration and Science Experiments, or DSX, satellite mission is complete. Designed by the Air Force Research Lab for Technology Development and Demonstration, DSX was also built as a platform for science experiments. Roughly the size of a football field, the satellite had four suites all designed to learn more about medium Earth orbit and to test advanced spacecraft control techniques. The team's lead science investigator says the lessons learned from the data collected will continue to affect the design of future Air Force Research Laboratory spacecraft. And that's your look around the Air Force.